what is up you guys this is my video on how to get open at on xbox live it is december 30th so this is pretty up to date first of all this is for wireless um xbox live users also for linksys routers which is in the title so that's probably why you clicked on it but anyways you're gonna start out of course on your xbox 360 and you want to turn it on, of course, and then you're going to go to the My Xbox tab of all these. You're going to go all the way over to System Settings. Hit A. You're going to go to Network Settings. And then you're going to go to Configure Network. Well, see, I'm connected to my network, which is on top, and then it depends on if your Xbox or your, your wireless adapter finds this stuff, but mine does, so I have this automatic, and you can figure this out. If you set it to automatic, it'll find one, then you just type in all this manual, but you want to make it a manual IP that isn't common, like you don't want a 192.168.1.1, and that's it, or dot .100 or something. Well, you could do dot one hundred. That's fine, actually. But um, I just chose one hundred and nine because that's I don't know. That's what I chose. It doesn't matter what it is. If you guys want, you can copy it. It's perfectly fine. And then after you do that, you need to shut off your Xbox and then get on your computer, which is what I will show you next. What's up, you guys? This is the computer part of how to get open that on Xbox Live. First of all, you want to get on your computer, open up your internet browser, it doesn't matter what it is. And since we're doing Linksys, you want to go to 192.168.1.1 in your address bar. The It should come up with this uh, sign in thing. And what you got to do, you got to type in admin. Actually, this is default, sorry, and then admin again. But mine is not admin, so let me type in mine. Okay, and then you should be brought to this screen if you have a link to E3000 or like somewhere around that, uh, whenever it was new or whatever. Uh, but if you have an older one that should look different, I don't know, maybe they updated it, I have no idea. I don't have an old one, so I wouldn't know. Oh, fail. <laughs> and then you want to go to a tab called Applications Gaming, Port Range Forwarding, and you want to have, just make up an application name, it can be Jimmy. Bob, it doesn't matter, fail, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what it is. It just has to be the same as this one too, but we're not going to get to that yet. Then the first port you want to do, you want to do 88 there, 88 there. Leave this at both. Set this to the IP address you used on your Xbox. Check enable. Do the exact same application name as this one. You're going to do 3074, 3074, both same IP, enabled. Going to hit save settings. Hit continue, or it might redirect to you, I don't know. And then you want to go to the sub tab, port range triggering. Exact same application name as the port range forwarding, right here. Same exact one. Then you're going to do all 88s in the first one. Well, actually, it doesn't matter what order it's in. Just They all have to be 88s, all four sections. Make sure that checkbox is enabled. Exact same application name again, all 3074. Make sure that checkbox is enabled. And hit save settings again. Hit continue or it'll redirect you. Now you're going to go to the administration tab. And you're going to make sure that UPNP, which is stands for Universal Plug and Play, make sure that's enabled. Make sure it's not, not disabled. Make sure it's enabled. You're going to hit save again. And now all you guys have to do, you can close that, you don't need to, but you can close that. And now go to your router, unplug it, or turn it off if there's a button to unplug it. Uh, turn it back on and go on like Modern Warfare 2, Black Ops, it doesn't matter. Or you can just text your Xbox Live connection and it'll tell you what your NAT type is. It should be open. If it's not, you most likely did something wrong. 
and you should go back and watch this video again. Thanks for watching, guys. Subscribe, comment if you have any problems.